What's up YouTube, Maggie Tutorials here. Today I'll be showing you how to enable Firefox's built-in PDF reader. That's right, built-in. This is a new addition to Firefox 15 and plus. If you want to check to see if you have that, click the Firefox button, hover over help, and click about Firefox. In my case I have 15.0.1, you might have 15 point whatever, I mean, you might have 500, but obviously anything above 15 is going to have this built-in, but you have to enable it. So the first thing you gotta do is go to your address bar and type in about config. Then you wanna click I'll be careful I promise. If you follow these steps exactly, you won't do anything bad. Then up in the search, type browser dot preferences dot n capital C O N T E N T. That'll be in the description, the first little code thing. Um, the value will by default be set as false. You want to right click on the preference name and click toggle. Then that will make it true. Now go back up into the search and type in pdfjs.disabled. That'll be in the, the next code. Then for the value it will be set as true. Right click it and make and click toggle to make it false because you do not want it disabled. Now you're going to have to disable the Adobe version uh, for a PDF reader because we all know that literally everything is better than Adobe. Everything. All PDF readers. So you're going to click Firefox, add-ons, click plugins, scroll through it. I already have it disabled. It might be Adobe Acrobat. Just read the description if it says Adobe PDF plugin for Firefox and Netscape. Click disable. Uh, if you have Foxit Reader or any other program like that, then you'll also have to disable that, otherwise this will not work. Now to test it, just open up a new tab, go and find a PDF file, drag it right up to the address bar, and as you can see, it opens up. Uh, it's a little bit minimalistic, I guess you could say. It's, well, actually it is a lot. Toggled slider for the table of contents. Uh, you have an outline if there is one. You can click the up and down arrow, you can change the page number, zoom in or out, change the zoom, you can download it, or you can uh, copy or open in a new window. Uh, let's see, this is not, no, it's not doing anything, so I guess that's just, it kind of depends. So it's definitely a lot more minimalistic than Adobe Reader. It doesn't have all the functions of it. If you still want those, you can obviously download it, use the uh, Adobe Reader offline version or a Foxit reader or something like that but if you're just looking for a kind of simple a simple really quick and slim reader for built in on the browser like in Chrome this will definitely work so that is how to enable Firefox's built in PDF reader thank you for watching if you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a thumbs up don't forget to circle me on Google Plus and if you want more tutorials subscribe